In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, one God. Amen. Hello, I'm Father Paul, and this is the good news. Christ is in our midst. That the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart be acceptable in your sight, O Lord, my strength and my Redeemer. A reading from the Holy Gospel, according to St. Matthew, chapter 21, verses 12 through to 22. Then Jesus went into the temple of God and drove out all those who brought and sold in the temple and overturned the tables of money changes and the seats of those who sold doves. And he said to them, It is written, My house shall be called a house of prayer, but you have made it a den of thieves. Then the blind and the lame came to him in the temple, and he healed them. But when the chief priests and the scribes saw the wonderful things that he did, the children crying out in the temple and saying, Hosanna to the son of David, they were indignant. And they said to him, Do you hear what these are saying? And Jesus said to them, Yes, have you never read out of the mouth of babes and nursing infants? You have perfected praise. Then he left them and went out of the city to, to Bethany, and he lodged there. Now in the morning, as he returned to the city, he was hungry, and seeing a fig tree by the road, he came to it, and found nothing on it but leaves. And he said to it, Let no fruit grow on you ever again. And made the fig tree withered away. And when the disciples saw it, they marveled, saying, How did the fig tree wither away so soon? So Jesus said to them, Assuredly, I say to you, If you have faith and do not doubt, you will not only do what was done to the fig tree, but also if you say to this mountain, be, moved, re, be removed and be cast into the sea, and it will be done. And whatever things you ask in prayer, believe you will receive. Glory to you, O God. Come, Holy Spirit. Fill our hearts with your love. Help us in the understanding of your words and teachings. Help us to be true and faithful followers of yours. In the scripture reading from St. Matthew today, there's two subheadings. The first one, Jesus purifies the temple. When Jesus went into the temple, he saw people buying and selling. He overturned the tables of the money changers and the seats of those who sold doves. And then cried out and said, My house shall be called a house of prayer, but you have made it a den of thieves. A house of prayer. Jesus is purifying now the church. We must remember this. People have come into the church and made it a place to make money. Jesus drove them out of the temple. And saying to them, My house shall be called a house of prayer, but you have made it a den of thieves. The second subheading in this reading, it says, Israel, the withered fig tree. It's a bit strange when you read this. And Jesus comes and is returning to Jerusalem. He sees on the road a fig tree. 
he's hungry. He came to it and looked for some figs, but there was nothing there. And he said, let no fruit grow in you on you ever again. Immediately, the fig tree withered away. Why? We must remember. We must remember in the church, if we do not bear fruit, we will wither away as a church. Just as this fig tree did. And this, the subheading says, Israel. Well, of course. If it does not bear fruit, it will wither away, just like the church is. We must learn. Yes, we must learn from this. If we don't start producing fruit, good fruit, the church will wither away. Stop making the temple a den of thieves. Start making it a house of prayer and produce good fruit. Glory to you, O God. And may the blessing of Almighty God, Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit be with you now and forever. Amen. 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 Most holy Theodorus, save us. Amen.